Hi everyone, and welcome back to another ANSIG how-to. Today, we will be showing you how to wire an RJ45 AP8C Ethernet cable connector via the B standard. Here are the tools you'll need. An RJ45 AP8C connector, a Cat5e cable, a cable stripper, scissors or pliers, a crimping tool, and a network testing tool. We'll first need to remove around 30 millimeters of the plastic covering to expose the inner wires. Place the cable stripper along the plastic cover. Adjust the blade length using the knob so it only cuts into the cover. Spin the stripper, remove and pull off the PVC. If any wires are damaged, adjust the blade length and retry. We will now need to remove the plastic divider. Separate the inner wires from the spine and cut the divider off with pliers. Now untwist and straighten out the wires. Now we need to order the wires in the B standard as shown. A and B offer the same electrical properties and either standard can be used. It does not matter which one you choose as long as you follow the same standard for both ends of the plug. For this video, we will be following the B standard. Once lined up according to the B standard, cut them evenly using the cutting blade of the crimping tool so they sit flush inside the connector. With the plug tab facing down, and the pins facing up, insert the wires into the connector in this order. Ensure that the wires are in the correct order and they aren't inverted. Each wire should be pushed in all the way and the outer PVC layer is anchored just inside the plug. Using the crimping tool, securely crimp the AP8C connector into the cable by placing it in this area and clamp. This will slice and secure the wires so a connection is made and will clamp down the PVC and hold it in place. In order to know that the connector is working properly, we will need to test it using a network tester like this one. Once both ends are completed, plug the connectors into both sides of the tester and turn the switch on. If wired correctly, the tester will filter through each wire and the illuminated light will flash sequentially from one to eight. If the lights flash up in the wrong order, you may have wired the connector incorrectly. And if any light does not flash up, you may have severed a connection. For any more questions or for assistance, visit our website or refer to the contact numbers at the end of this video. Thank you for watching and we'll see you next time.